It's end tonight. A painted heart in San Francisco's Union Square has been replaced with a different statue in the shape of a rabbit. Kate Fuse, Janet Kasiyama joins us now. She's live to explain how it's part of a new tradition with the city's Lunar New Year celebration. Jana. Yes, it was kind of an unexpected surprise to see some of these rabbits around town. The Year of the Rabbit begins this Sunday with the Chinese Zodiac for Lunar New Year. And in San Francisco, they decided to place these beautiful animal statues around town. It's a virtual parade that began during the pandemic. Peer around a corner in San Francisco, and you might just find yourself bumping into a bunny. The meaning behind the rabbit is it's peaceful, harmonious, good luck. So we really tried to embody a lot of that this year. It's the year of the rabbit, and five of these statues have popped up around San Francisco, each sponsored by a local company and painted by a local artist. We've wanted them to be larger than life and something that people can enjoy interacting with, taking pictures with. Stephanie Muffson is one of the artists and the San Francisco Lunar New Year Parade event coordinator. She says the idea for painted statues began two years ago when the parade was canceled due to the pandemic. It turned out to just become this really beautiful way of integrating the art into the community and having a way for artists to have another voice. Muffson's rabbit greets riders at the new Chinatown subway station, a sky blue for her sponsor, Sky River Casino. Outside Chase Center, another rabbit waits ready for the Warriors' New Year's celebration on Saturday. The clouds have the meaning of happiness. The bunny, named Bravery, represents speed, strength, and good fortune for the team, according to the Chinese artist Yi Young Dung, who painted it. Bamboo, they grow very fast and they are very strong and they are very straight. Dung says the holiday has deep meaning for him and many others far from home. New Year's to me is the family time, the warm feeling. Artist Robin Zhao helped paint the lucky supermarket rabbit that was placed at Lakeshore Plaza and she designed the rabbit at Union Square. I use uh, cherry blossoms for also for luck and peace and some coins because Chinese people love money and uh, um, yeah, and who doesn't like wealth for the new year, right? <laughs> wealth, good luck, and a connection to traditions held close to the heart. Chinese New Year to me is kind of like, oh, welcome back home where you were born. In. So it's kind of like a celebration, tying me into like, you know, Chinese American back into my Chinese culture. And these beautiful rabbits will be on display until Sunday, February 5th. There is a photo contest, so if you post photos and add the hashtag uh, rabbits on parade, Mike and Julie, then you might actually be able to win a prize. Hashtag rabbits, rabbits on, on parade. parade. I like that idea. You know, when all is said and done, the celebration is over. What actually happens to these rabbits? Well, they, what they're going to be doing is they're actually going to be put up on auction. And so all of the proceeds from those sales will benefit four community groups, the nonprofits here in the area. Yeah. Yeah, definitely fun to see around the city. Jenna, thank you. Well, the Alaska Airlines Chinese New Year Parade in San Francisco is coming up on Saturday, February 4th. And for the first time since the pandemic, you can watch it live right here on KTVU. We hope you'll join us for KTVU News at 5, all followed by the parade at 6. All right.